Welcome back. And now I have two legends, legends that are not far gone. They're right here. I'm Philip. How are you? Very good, thank you. And Glenn. Doing well. Good That's night. That's great. Now, I just recently discovered, I love this. I've been here for 10 years now. I came back, came back to Worcester. And suddenly I find out about you guys. I hear about this, these wonderful performers that, that were coming to Mechanics Hall, our beautiful, majestic Mechanics Hall. And then I find out you're the brain children behind it. So tell me how it got started. Well, time will tell whether we're the brain children or not. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> it, it started with um, Glenn and I uh, got together when he moved back into the area and we started going to a lot of music shows. And Glenn pointed out to me that there was a hole in Worcester. Uh, we're traveling all over the state in Central Mass. And that's the only way that we can see the music that we want to see from our demographic, basically. That's great. And you're right. Worcester's the second largest city of New England. Yes, Worcester's the second largest next to Boston. And we can we can support a venue like Mechanics Hall and wonderful performances too. Yeah. So Glenn, you have a, a production or producing background, correct? I do. And, and again, when we started talking, Phil and I and um, our spouses, Lauren and Gail, and it's kind of a family operation. Uh, Over a little bourbon, maybe? Um, that's mine. It actually, <laughs> <laughs> I think it actually was. Uh, yeah. <laughs> and then uh, we said, you know, I, I said, I really do think there's a hole here. And as, as the area has changed over the past, you know, three or four decades, right. um, where Worcester and Boston are, are kind of uh, butting right up against each other, um, Worcester, I think, makes a lot more sense as a place to have this type of a business. Um, because Worcester is an easier place for a lot of artists to get to. Sure. Um, it's also from a facility standpoint. There are wonderful venues here. We thought Mechanics Hall was being underutilized for this kind of thing. And uh, when a performer steps on the stage at Mechanics Hall, uh, there has not been one yet. And we've done several shows now. Um, you know, they Maria Maldar. They, they rave about the space, the yeah. sound, the acoustics. Uh, yeah. And actually, I think we're doing a good job of hospitality with uh, Lauren and Gail providing most of that. Oh, I'm and sure. And it's working well with the performers. Right. And you, you like, you're like a Worcesterite, like I am. And I don't know what your ethnic background, but I believe all of us are ethnic <laughs> in Worcester. We open up our doors. We're hospitable to our guests, regardless of who they are, especially legends. And Mechanics Hall, I don't know if our audience knows this, our viewers, but that's where Yo-Yo Mon's one, one of his favorite places in, to conduct the symphony orchestra, the Boston Symphony Orchestra. And now you have these legends on there and pass it on to them. That Yo-Yo Mon is like, this is his favorite place to perform, is well, what he said. A lot yeah. of people really like it there. Yeah, uh, when they step up on stage, generally, the very first thing anyone says is they look out and they go, wow. Exactly. It's Those usually three the first letters. <laughs> wow. Um, and you know what I loved about it coming in, knowing I was going to see rock and roll? You can dress down. I mean, I've been in there where you have to dress up, but dress down. So now, Simply Far Gone is the name dressing of... Dressing up. <laughs> Glitter, <laughs> bling. Dressing down to me is my jeans, and you know, I okay. always dress up anyway, but jean like. <laughs> huh. But anyway, so tell us about Simply Far Gone. Um, you have some great performances coming up. And uh, you're, as you're speaking throughout this interview, your uh, website, which is very clear on, and it's got a good chronology calendar. So maybe tell us a, f a few of the performers coming. Well, we've got. Uh, actually uh, almost two years worth of dates now that are um, held in the hall. Uh, the things we've announced so far are, uh, well, the, the three, uh, four we've done would be, um, you know, Maria Maldar came, was a wonderful show, Tom Rush, wonderful show, um, Legends. Legends of Country Rock, which, right. uh, which we that was the one you at, went to. Um, was just amazing, and I don't know when the last time there's been a concert in Worcester that got out at about quarter of 12. Yeah, uh, <laughs> I know. And with three bands on stage at the end for the finale, all working together, I that was the name. It was, it was yeah, amazing. we did Crystal Bower Socks, and then coming up um, mm -hmm. is 
uh, Jonathan Edwards, yes. which will be wow. a wonderful show. Yep. Uh, we've got an incredible blues show that, that Phil is particularly passionate about. I saw that. I'm really looking forward to that. Charlie Farron, Jeff yep. Pitchell and Texas Flood. The I headliners are John Hammond and Johnny A. And my understanding is for the finale, again, it's not going to be just one band up there. We're going to have more than one guy up there That's for great. the finale. All I can say is that, really, log on to the website, and if you like any kind of music, regardless if it's country, rock and roll, blues, jazz, just go on and pick the one you like. Go to at least one of them, if not all of them. I mean, I always look on the Ticketmaster to find out what's coming all over the New England area. Now it's right in Worcester. Simplyfiregone.com. Yeah. They can find it right there. Thank yeah. you so much for doing this. Thank you for being the legends, for bringing the legends in. You will be the legends. I don't know. When you say legend, it makes you sound like you got one foot in the grave. But <laughs> no, yeah, no, 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 no. There's okay. lots of legends okay, without okay. having one foot in the grave. And if you are, you can be on my Sixth Sense and Beyond show. <laughs> we'll come back. Yeah. We'll come back. <laughs> yeah, Catherine go. will bring you back. Thank we'll you so back. much. Thank, thank you. you. It was so a pleasure. Much. Thank Thanks you for, for having us on tonight. Appreciate it. Yes, absolutely. And I'll see you again.